Donica, a victory over the champions. How big is that result? Yeah, it's good. It's really good. We're delighted with it. I think uh, we, yeah, we played really well. I think they'll be disappointed how they went, but from our end, it was a, a, a vital win that we really needed. And I think maybe our want was a little bit greater today, which is good to see. We've been disappointed, though, and if, uh, you know that's the honest truth. And I think as a group of lads, I think we've underperformed in the league. And I know how Saracens will look at it. You know that we can pick it up for a big scalp like them, you know, European champions, uh, Premiership champions and play really well and that's not good enough sometimes, you have to be good week in, week out and that's learning from for us now to have consistency in our performance because, you know, when you can do it out there against one of the best teams and, and look, take nothing away, they, they, they will be disappointed, I'd say they feel they underperformed but we have to back it up and I think it's it's only respect for Saracens and the other teams in the league. I think we've been disappointing in the league and we need to be better. A game full of effort and intensity and you seem to get a really good response from the crowd when you came off at the end. What did you say to them? No, no not at all. Look, the crowd, it, look, in, in crucial games like that, you, you honestly don't know how important the crowd is. It really is so important. and like I'm half embarrassed about what I was at, but uh, I, just for them to, you know, to, to really dig in behind the team, there is massive... They influence things. You, you, you would be surprised how maybe a tight call might go your way if the crowd is on, on side with the team. And look, they've always been great. It's just sometimes to recognise that as a player as well, and times that they need you need them. And look, they've been great. And look, if I was to be honest, they've been brilliant for us in ter in times where we haven't performed for them. And I think we owe them an awful lot when they come in week in week out, stick with the team through an awful lot of uh, rocky road and you know it, like we need to perform and, and do better for them because they've been great it's extra at home again next week and you'll be hoping for more of the same yeah look it's another massive challenge like i'll be honest there was fear all week you play saracens there's fear because they can you know you could be on the the end of a a massive result and it's the same at exeter exeter quality team we need to play beyond ourselves and and hope a bit, with no disrespect to Saracens, but I think, like we said, they would have felt that they underperformed. And, you know, if maybe Exeter underperform and we can play beyond ourselves, then we have a shot, you know. And look, I'm not being disrespectful, but that's where we are at the moment. We just need to have consistency in our performance. We can't uh, put in a shift like today and then go out and just be really poor next week. So I think that's the big drive for us.